Imagine your application has a random pop-up or dialog like this. So for example, I click enter the name and then enter the name successfully and click submit. Then click it again and again click it successfully. Click it again and now I see this kind of friendly reminder. Remember, name should start with the capital case. I click OK and then I can enter the name. And I cannot predict when will I have this pop-up. And somehow I need to automate this flow to enter the name. So let me show you how to automate this with a playwright. All right, closing this, going back to test application. I set up a quick script. So we navigate to the dialog page. Uh, then we enter the name, fill the item and click the submit. Uh, let me try to run this like a multiple times and we can see that it will randomly fail. And for that, uh, Playwright has a very nice uh, command npx uh, playwright test. You can use flag dash dash repeat each. So this is useful to kind of debug your flaky scenarios if, you know, test randomly fails. Let's say I want to repeat this test five times. And uh, if you want to execute this test sequentially, make sure that you put the workers to one. Otherwise, your test will be executed in parallel all five threads. So I uh, start this test and look what's going to happen. So it's first attempt and it's failed. The second attempt it's passed, third attempt, fourth, and uh, attempt number five, and some of that is failed. Let's look into the report. We see that two times it passed, three times is failed. Yes, because we have a random pop-up. How to manage this randomness? So going back to the test. In our scenario, this is the step after which this uh, random pop-up is possible. So before that, we need to create a, a locator handler that is available in the playwright uh, to manage this random pop-up. So I type await page and use method add locator handler. So inside of this method, we need to provide two arguments. First argument will be the locator, which gonna be the trigger for this handler to be executed. So let's look into this locator and we can take uh, this, for example, friendly reminder text. So if we see this on the page, then we need to click on OK button for this um, uh, pop-up or dialog box to disappear. So I will provide a locator, for example, page uh, let's use get by text and provide this text. So this will be a trigger. And then when it's triggered, the uh, result will be a async function like this. And then what should be done is page uh, get by role. We need to click on that OK button. So button and we click OK. That's click like this. Uh, okay, I need to put it right here with a name. Okay, now everything looks correct. So let's try to run this test one more time and I will use the uh, sequential execution five times one more time to see if it's gonna work. So number one, number two, number three, number four, and number five, and everything worked correctly. All five times execution for this scenario passed successfully. So this locator handler worked successfully. So that's it guys. So quick and elegant solution to manage those annoying pop-ups and dialog boxes, just to make sure that you add this locator handler before the step that can trigger this locator handler. And then Playwright will do everything automatically. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. Put the like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.